in a world more interconnected than ever before. We are unexpectedly affected by things that we cannot see and things we do not know. But there is a world beyond the public eye, a place that the media tells you to fear, a no-go zone. Follow Mike, a world traveler, bringing us to no-go zone stateside and abroad. A travel documentary series that breaks barriers. Mike goes to the places that others are afraid of, where no one else dares to go, to tell their story, the story the media forgets to tell you. See the other side of places like Baltimore, Southside Chicago, Opalaka, Syria, and more at MikeNoGoZones.com or Mike no Go Zones on YouTube. After my visit to the brewery, I came across my biggest surprise in Opalaka, and that was a Hindu temple. Opalaka has a population of Guyanese, Trinidadians, and other Caribbean immigrants of Indian background. I was made to feel welcome, even though I was a total outsider. They were willing to speak to me about their faith and culture. I learned more about his faith in 10 minutes than I ever could from any book. Wow. Uh, and there is, there's, there's more than a history. History just has something that has attention. Mm -hmm. This is more than attention. This is a life support that what happened in here right now in Upalaka as bringing a Hindu temple nowhere from all the way from India mm. and bring it all the way to Upalaka. So this temple was born in Upalaka in 2003. Wow. We was having a very uh, issue about cities, how can we be able to have a temple and there was some way from a divine point mm -hmm. and from a universal energy Upalaka was one of the place that we we kept in our mind, but we didn't have no uh, finance to come to Upalaka. And there was one day we look at 75 temples from Broward and Lake County, and the last moment that we found in the newspaper, there's a church here wow. for rent, and then we came here and we make this place our home now. There's a, there's a main deity, is called Mariamman. Mm -hmm. This is a southern part of India deity. When I say deity, it's a, it's a physical form of energy from the five elements. And this five element becomes from Mari. The word Mariamman means rain, means grace. Mm. And Upalaka maybe looks with a lot of uh, rowdy people and a lot of uh, robbery. But Upaha, Upalaka becomes a heaven and earth because of what, uh, in a very fine-tuned way, that you could see uh, Maria Mendes living in Upalaka. Uh, she's blessing thousands and thousands of people every year, walking here in all walks of life to be able to come here to receive the blessing. Wow, that's a, that's a great story. That's incredible. So that was going to be my next follow-up question. So are people of, like, for example, I'm not Hindu, but I felt pretty welcome here. Because yeah. we, we, we understand there is, it becomes thus mm -hmm. in a way in life that we have to think that there's nothing is intact or tag on to us as we own anything. So when we give up this ownership about anything else on the outside, we think this is a value part of our life. Knowing our brothers and sisters, mm -hmm. to know our faith becomes so strong and concretize in our way that nothing could shift us because our system of belief is so strong that we're able to rise from one level to the next level. And this place becomes a grace place for us. That's fantastic, wow. It's you can uh, see if you turn back a little bit, yeah, sure. all those are the musicians and all mm -hmm. those are the, the devotees that come here yeah. on a voluntary task. No mm. one is get no reward only by doing devotional. Mm. and giving uh, service to this DV called Mario Man, which is a great sign in our life. That's great, man. It's about thousands and thousands of years ago. It's still operating. Uh, hundreds and hundreds of thousands of people will go to the, uh, the secret temple mm -hmm. and able to receive 
some kind of enlightenment. So what we are really practicing here is not something from a two years ago. This is from thousands and thousands of years. The hymns have very, very voltage. Uh, uh, it has very voltage words that has very deep meaning about your soul. Mm. How your soul should be react and act in a higher consciousness. And we have a, a meditation place here too. Sure, sure. Uh, Hey, this is Mike from No-Go Zones. I love creating and sharing this series with you. I would be appreciative if you could like, comment, and share these videos with your friends and family. And don't forget to subscribe.